Dealing with my hearing loss was very challenging and upsetting. My hearing would get lower and lower every day. I wasn't born deaf, but I started to lose my hearing in the third grade. Now, when I was in third grade, it was horrible. People would constantly bully me and shame me. And now the teacher was causing this. I'm not going to say her real name. So for the sake of this story, I'm going to call her Mrs. Cooley. So what I mean when she caused this, I mean she pick on me by calling on me when my hand's not raised or telling me I'm lying about my hearing loss and getting me suspended for absolutely no reason. Oh, I knew you can hear me. You just don't want to listen. No, I'm not saying she's a bad person, but I'm saying she could have been more supportive as a teacher. By fourth grade, eh, my hearing grew worse. While my mom at the time was in the hospital, I've had help from my aunt and my grandmother, who I'm truly thankful for. So when I told my aunt about my hearing, she took me to the audiologist, who was really very nice. So probably a couple weeks after that, I got my hearing aids, but they weren't working out for me so well. When sixth grade came around, I got my first cochlear implant. It helped a lot, but it wasn't enough. So I got another one, and it helped tremendously. But now, when I meet new people, I always say the question, what is that on your head? I keep explaining, but when more and more people ask me, it's actually starting to get more and more annoying, and it's actually affecting my ability to make friends. You know why? Because most people who see me with my cochlear implants think I'm weird. And a lot of people say I can't do anything or I won't be able to accomplish my dreams. But you know what? That's just more motivation for me. But yeah, if you see me doing, if you see me still doing my comedy skits or my reaction videos or my gaming videos when I'm feeling at my lowest, that's because I love you guys and I want you guys to be entertained. But I also want to entertain myself. So people with disabilities or just people, <laughs> uh, don't let anyone tell you what you can and cannot do. Because if you let those people get in your head, you may fall behind. And you should show love to everybody. And to you, Miss Kool-Aid, I'm still upset. I have no hate towards you. I hope you're doing well. Alright, I guess it's the uh, end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Um, if you want to um, follow my Twitter and uh, Instagram, it's up there. Also, if you want to subscribe to the channel, my channel bubble will be down there. Um, if you want to see uh, my last video, it's up there as well. And if you want to um, could subscribe to my gaming channel, it will be right there under my last video. So uh, thanks again for watching. I love you all and uh, peace out.